when I went to Europe the first time, I, I was surprised. See, walking lunch. Walking, how can we, how can we talk when we are eating? We are not supposed to talk when we are eating. We are supposed to eat. So, so me, what I do, I eat it before. When I come to, to, the, to the talk, to walking lunch, I just come to sit there and because I cannot manage to talk and at the same time eat. It's terrible to talk when you have food in your mouth. But now, this is the culture of other societies that you have working life. So I, I don't do anything. I just, me, I eat early. And I just come and sit there to talk because I cannot manage to. In the tribes, in the tribes, Everything was reg was regimented. How to talk, how to sit, how to eat. For instance, in, in, in my my tribe, you cannot talk when you are eating. Food in your mouth. Huh? You are supposed to, 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 to eat, chew the food, swallow, and then you talk. But now somebody is with food in the mouth, is talking. So how are you going to handle all this uh, transition? It's a big challenge for the families and the, the societies as a whole. But the... the, the when it comes to families, I think Africa now is in a, in a crisis. Because part of the virus, even when, even, even when we have solved other problems, we have solved the problem of education, we have solved the problem of uh, empowerment, uh, I think there is also a problem of, of culture. Because traditionally, in, the, in our tribes, people know how to speak. How to speak to one another, how to answer questions, how to, to behave, how to sit. But now, these tri tribal customs are dying out and they are being replaced by a vacuum, a vacuum of, of culture. So you can even find fights starting because of talking badly to each other, because people don't know how to talk to each other. I, I am going to do this, I'm going to do this. I'm... Now, how would you... So, even when, the, even when there are no economic issues or what, but because of the buyaism. In Uganda here we have got a very good word, buyaism. A muyai is, we would call it in Francais, element de classe. Element de classe. The class element, people are just behaving like uh, they, they have no culture. Uh -huh. This is a big issue which we, we need to talk about. Uh, how do we, this ministry, like this Minister of Women, Minister of Culture, to synthesize some of the old customs, the, the good ones, so that when the children are growing up, they are they are helped. They are helped. If the if the families can help them, train them how to talk, how to behave, it will be good. But children just grow up like uh, wild wild trees. Uh, th there will be a problem. Yes, 
If we solve education, we solve empowerment, then you'll have new problems like the breakup of families. People get married, after six months they divorce. Because they don't know how to relate to one another, how to talk to each other, how to, <laughs> you know. They are wild. Wild. Mwavana, Munoku Manya, Avazade Banoku Vai Giriza, Engiri Yoko Geramu, Yoko Uza Avantu, Yoko Tura, because Yes, we, we, the children now have problem. We now have problems because of uh, lack of this, lack of that, lack of that. Uh, but we are working on that. In time, we shall overcome it. But even after that, how about the civilizational level? We need a new rational culture distilling distilling some of the old customs and I will give you an example as a way of concluding. In the past we used to have arranged marriages. In my tribe when a child, when a boy was uh, 16 or something like that, I would go and negotiate with the family. The boy would not be involved, and we finish the matters, and we bring the girl and we say, "Talk fair, we have got a wife for you." That was the old way. Now, this one is no longer acceptable. The children must get their own partners. That's fantastic. But for me, I'm still reserving my role when my children were growing up. I did not want to retire completely from playing the role so I retreated from being on the front line, but I remained in the background as a consultant. <laughs> the idea was you go and reconnoiter, and if you see something good, come and ask me about it. Because I may give you an opinion. You, 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 you may say, I have seen so and so's daughter with wonderful, then I, mean, I, I may know something about that family because I'm a, I'm a consultant. I may know something about the family, I say, no, no, that family, uh, no, 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 because th there is something there, there, there. Now, if my children now dismiss me for my job of consultancy, then how do I make an input into these people's lives? So you can find all sorts of complications because of unplanned breakdown of the old society without being replaced by something well thought out. So as you talk of violence, violence, Yes, some of the virus is due to shortages. Lack of jobs, lack of education, lack of money, lack of... But even with money, even with the no economic hardships, you can have a cultural collapse. As has happened in some of the Western societies, because those Western societies have everything there. They have... A, they have most of the things, not everything, but most of the things. But the families have broken down. 
There are no families. Now there's a new concept of a new family that uh, a man can marry a man and a, a woman can marry a woman. So you can see that there are a lot of issues. Uh, that Minister of Women and Culture is a very serious ministry. He needs to really do a lot of, of, of thinking how to distill good things from the past, discard, discard the bad ones, and synthesize the, the good and you give it to our children there.